Yo, what's up everyone? It's your boy Connor from Single Sip American Coffee Trip. You find me here in Laconia, New Hampshire. Um, I'm right by like the New England Coffee Festival stand for the amphitheater thing for the block party that happened last night. Um, but we will be doing a video on the coffee festival itself later today, as well as the other Wayfair Coffee Roasters location. I'm reviewing the main one right over, basically across the street from here. One to cord right here though, because it's got the big bold letters, New England Coffee Festival. And I got a big old 16 ounce cup here, which, uh, you know, it's usually a little bit larger than I uh, typically go, but it's what they had for, for here cup. So I'd rather go for a mug than a paper cup. And uh, I actually really, really like the feel of it. And they seem to like emboss their uh, logo. Almost everything, all their kind of plates, cutlery cups, all that bullshit. Um, but yeah, crema quality is really good. It's got a good jiggle effect right there. A uh, little bit thin on the base, um, but it got better the further up you went. Um, and that really has to do with spout proximity. But overall, pretty nice. I did hear a claim last night that these guys were the best coffee roaster in New England. That's a bold claim. And you know, I don't really know what to expect. Um, but I've been to a lot of fantastic coffee shops around New England. And, uh, well, we'll see if these guys back up that claim. I'll take a sip. That's not the best coffee shop in New England, but that's good. It also doesn't even make top, it doesn't make top pick status either. This is right on par with a coffee shop I went to in Western Mass called Lennox Coffee. The guy did a beautiful maple leaf latte design on there. Coffee behind it didn't, didn't back it up as much though. But the integration was perfect. This pour was really amazing. Karma quality was great. Sometimes it's just the characteristics of the espresso that can like really hold it back or send it higher. What's up? Hi, do you know where we're supposed to park? For the New England Coffee Festival? Yep. Um, no, I don't. Do you know who to ask? Uh, do you know? What's that? Where we should, where we need to park? Are you uh, setting up for the, probably on the street right here, I'm guessing, but I'm not sure. I, I have a map, it says we're supposed to be on Beacon Street, but nothing's toned off or anything. I have no, I don't work for the festival, I'm sorry. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're just taking part of it. Okay, thanks. <laughs> Good luck, guys. And as you can see, people setting up for the event, some of them confused. Honestly, I don't know what to expect either, but I'm excited for it. But, but with that being said, speaking of which, I'm gonna give that a 7.8. That's delicious. No, these guys know their stuff. I mean, that's not a bad score at all. That's not, that's obviously not New England best. I'm gonna find a multitude. I already have found a multitude of places that I consider to be better. Um, but if you're up in this area and you wanna stop by a coffee shop, by all means, this is the one to go to. Um, so all I gotta say, I gotta review the other one now. Maybe that will be a little bit better, a little bit worse, who knows? I got a breakfast sandwich waiting for me inside, and uh, got some new, new t-shirt for the event as well. 
So I'm ready. I'm amped. I'll see you guys next time.